breakfast taco before race day. What is going on, Shift Talk TV? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to a race day vlog. Today I'm going to document um, my first vlog, actually going over what it looks like for me to go out and race for a weekend. So, yesterday I went out and practiced at the Dallas Karting Complex. Today we're going to have a club race, should be pretty competitive. Not sure how many entries there are in my class, but I'll be racing uh, KA100 Senior. Um, should be a pretty wicked day though. So join me as we go along and uh, hop into race day. Should be pretty sick. Thanks for joining. All right guys, so I just ate my breakfast taco. Now I'm feeling prepped and ready. I'm gonna head inside. I'm gonna take care of registration, get all signed up and everything, get my transponder, very, very important. Oop, I did remember the battery to my Micron this time. I almost forgot it, but I remembered it. And then we got practice, and then we got qualifying, and then we're jumping into racing. Should be an absolutely sick day. Thank you guys so much for tagging along. I really appreciate it. Make sure to press that subscribe button if you like cars, karting, water sports, really just any action sports in general. I would love to have you as a subscriber on the channel. Thank you so much, and let's go on, and let's head inside and get registered. All right, y'all, so the pace yesterday that I was running in practice was actually pretty decent. I was only about nine-tenths of a second off of the guy who runs front of the pack, so I was pretty happy about that. But definitely need to keep the pace up today. Weather's a little bit colder, so hopefully we're getting some good grip, but I guess we're going to find out here shortly. Can you a practice on the sim? Race shop. Brand new sexy Lando. All right, boys. Here's the steed ready to roll. Beautiful day. Got another 100. Should be a super, super fun day. But we're going to have to get this transponder mounted here so we can track who's won in the race. We ought to get the Micron battery on, get some chain lube on, get tire pressure, fuel her up, and then we're ready to head out for practice. So I will catch up with y'all in just a minute. All right, guys. We just got done with free practice one. Cart is running so good. She is super, super smooth today. We got a 125 shifter running out there. It's a little bit loud, but grip is really good on the track. Power is really solid today. Air is nice and cold. The carts are loving it. So free practice one went really, really solid. So we're going to strap up, get ready for qualifying here, head on out, and uh, we'll definitely get you guys some content out there on the track. All right, here's my buddy Noah running his shifter. There's nothing like the sound of a 125 shifter. Those things just rip. Great. Hot. The shifters sound epic, though. You like the sound of the shifter? Oh, it's great. Nothing like it. They're just getting it on. All right, I got all the graphics peeled off, ready for some new graphics coming in. Finally get our own logos on it, which will be super epic. Cart's running really good, though. Got our Odenthal Racing Products GoPro mount attached. Ready to get some killer footage of race day. Go back out, get one more practice in before qualifying. No issues with the cart, I just keep dropping a back tire. Uh, this will now be my third sprocket this weekend. Y'all can see it's got a little wobble in there, but nothing too bad. Um, but we're gonna get that sprocket changed out and we're gonna get out on the track for qualifying. bending sprockets I need to guess quit cutting the track or something but uh, I'm just trying to pick up that extra half a second if you know what I mean but I keep dropping my back wheel off the uh, back corner of the track and bending sprockets so I've done three sprockets in two days so um, hopefully this was the last one right Steph yeah. 
All right, so we just finished qualifying. Super, super stoked. P2 in qualifying, which is super solid. I'm excited about that. Um, the guy ahead of me is running about a tenth faster, so not much. It's going to be some good racing. We're going to be going out for uh, Heat 1 here in just a minute. We'll get you all a good amount of videos. It's going to be super fun. I'm running the GoPro, so we'll put some onboard camera footage too. And then we'll head out for the final and wrap the day up. But hopefully we can wrap up the day on the podium. Pace is feeling good. Heart's feeling good. Just can't drop another wheel off of the curb and bend a sprocket. But uh, yeah, pace is feeling good. So we'll see you all out there in a minute. Woo! I spun out in the pre-final. I was uh, running P2. I was fastest lap of the session at a 51.9. Actually, my new personal best, so I'm super stoked about that. I was uh, chasing down P1. I was on his tail, on his bumper coming into turn one and locked him up a little too much. Went spinning into the barriers. Came back, um, got back up to fourth and finished fourth. So gonna be starting fourth heading into the final. Definitely need to turn it around and get on the podium. All right, Dom, we got final race of the day in what, 20, 30 minutes? Something like that. Talk to me about where the head's at going into this. Don't spin out this time. That's where it's at. I got my pit crew here. Got my lovely bride. Good luck, Charm. Best friend. What's up, peeps? Now we're meant more mentally in the zone now. Pace was really good, though. Fastest, even faster than P1, even though I spun out, so. Um, you know, that was good, catching back up to them, catching up to the group. But this time we're just going to uh, string it together, keep it out of the barriers, keep it smooth, keep it fast. And, uh, we'll see you when the race is over. Yep, catch you all in the final.
How are we feeling? Good. I'm happy we finally strung it together in the uh, in the final, which was super sick. Had the pace all weekend, so it was really, really nice to finally be able to put it together. And where'd you um, start? Started fourth. Ran through the pack. Rough start for the team. Uh, I, I personally had a good start, but what, it was six, seven car pile up, so um, yeah, a lot of people got stuck up in that, and I just slid around the outside into second, chased them for about five, six laps or so, and then uh, just had a window open up and made the move. Finished the race really strong, really smooth, no mistakes, fast laps. Wasn't as fast as I was in the uh, heat one, but still fast enough. So thanks y'all for tuning in to Shift Talk TV, and we'll catch y'all on the next episode.